everyone. This is Gina Gonzalez from Cooking for Health. Welcome to my kitchen. Tonight we're going to make a beautiful spaghetti squash to go with our meal. And I have a nice little organic spaghetti squash that we washed off. And it's ready to go. And we're just going to, it's super simple. All we're going to do is we're just going to go ahead and just put, poke a, slightly poke some holes in here just to help it kind of steam vapor cook through really easy and then we're gonna go ahead and put it right inside of our holy pan right and that fits right inside of our three quart we're just gonna add a little water to the bottom of the three quart and it's really nice to be able to cook the spaghetti squash when it's whole because then when it's done you just cut it in half and scrape the insides out and you have these beautiful noodles. So super simple. I'm not even gonna season it because once I get the noodles out of the inside, I'm gonna put some uh, pepper and garlic and oh, just, I'm gonna, what I'm gonna really do is brown up some garlic and uh, maybe probably some butter or avocado oil and with, with garlic and just put it over the top of it. And it's gonna be absolutely amazing. When you're cooking in Salad Master, you're not getting any of the leaching of the metal, so it doesn't change the flavor of the food. So everything just comes out tasting amazing. So we're just gonna get this on our stove on medium. And when the valve clicks, we're gonna turn it down to low. When spaghetti squashes take a little while to cook. It's kind of a smaller one, so probably probably be done in about 45 minutes and then I'll have to come back and show you how amazing it looks when we when we cut out the inside and then we just add the seasonings on top it's actually delicious the last time I made one I took it all out and I put pesto sauce on there I did a homemade pesto with basil and pine nuts and uh, I didn't put any cheese in it I just did basil pine nuts a little bit of olive oil and um, salt and pepper and garlic delicious and put, made our homemade pesto and put it right on top of the spaghetti squash. It was delicious and we had a great meal and it actually could be your main meal and it's really easy too to, once you scrape out and you have the noodles, you could put even spaghetti sauce on it and the kids think that it's just regular noodles and they're getting this great vegetable in their diet and along with thinking they're eating a spaghetti dinner <laughs> right so those are the ways to get help everyone get more vitamins and minerals help our kids be eating healthy right now is very important to build our immune system and make sure you're getting lots of fruits and vegetables in your diet so i'll touch back with you in a little bit with my completed spaghetti squash i'll show you how we cut it scrape out the inside and then we'll put some seasoning on it see you then